Hey everyone, it's Andrew. I have my new to me 2012 Mazda 5 and we're going to go ahead and install what has to be one of the easiest aftermarket parts on the car and that is the rear bumper guard from Mazda. I uh, got an OEM from them. Just got some double-sided tape on the back so let's take a moment to uh, clean off the back and get this installed. Come watch. So Mazda includes some instructions in the box for how to install this. We got uh, obviously the rear bumper guard it comes with an alcohol prep pad, but that is way too small, so we'll just use a bottle of alcohol and paper towel. And the basic gist of it is to clean the back bumper, do some test fits uh, to make sure that the locator arrow on the part itself is centered with the rear hatch striker. Going to remove the two pieces of tape, the small pieces, Put it on there, and then after that's installed, you take the little tab of the bigger piece and kind of pull it out the side and just push it down. So it's been a couple of weeks since I've actually cleaned the car, so the back of it has a bunch of um, just drippings from, from rain and dirt and all the road grime and everything that you do. So go ahead and clean it off with some simple green. Kind of wash it a couple times to make sure that all this gross stuff is not on the bumper when we go ahead and stick that on. Go ahead with some alcohol. Just make sure that that is as clean as it can possibly be. So here in the middle of the part, we have a little triangle to tell us where the center of the bumper guard is so that'll help us line it up with the uh, latch for the trunk so all we'll have to do is really just get that little mark centered with that we're gonna do a test fit just to make sure that everything is good everything seems nice we cleaned the entire area that we needed to so that's pretty much it for the test fit so you only want to remove the two sides, kind of the, the lower part before you install it. So you'll do the, the big one afterwards. So we got those on there, get it nice and centered with the catch. Kind of keeping it lifted up. Push it forward. Try to get that piece, those two sides, nice and stuck down. And once that's all good, you have your little tab on the far side here that you could still grab and you kind of pull that under and out. Pull that out and you go along. You're sticking it down. Kind of old rag. So that's it. That's the installation of the rear bumper guard on the 2012 Mazda 5. Probably pretty similar for the 2012 through 2015 models. Instructions say don't wash the car for 24 hours and to make sure it sits kind of 30 minutes at room temperature, but it's about 90 degrees here today at home, so not a big deal. Just clean up and we'll be good to go. Thanks for watching.